That is five quid. Best five quid you'll spend. We're in London and today we're going to take you out and eat our favourite London Eats. I'm Ross and Bex behind the camera. <laughs> Let's go. So when you're in London, you need to start your day with a full English breakfast. And Regency Cafe has been around since the 40s, dishing up basically the same breakfast they did way back then. It's got a really good reputation with all the locals and the tourists. They run a really tight ship. You're gonna line up when you come here, guys. Trust us, it's always busy every time we walk past. So when it's your turn to order, there's a couple of options you can make. But outside of that, there's no changes. But it does come with bacon, eggs, sausage, baked beans, and tomato. And then they throw in a couple of pieces of toast and a coffee, ridiculously cheap. What a start to the day. Wow, that was so good. The yolks are runny, the bacon's crispy and delicious. Always a winner. tip from my cousin Rich. Fortnum and Mason have been around for hundreds of years and they make, well they made the original scotch egg and he's like you've got to come in, go down the stairs, walk into this luxurious department store and pick out one of these and just smash it. So that's what we're about to do. Now we've just cut it open and you can see the runny yolk. That's exactly what you want to find in a good scotch egg. A bit similar to the one in the market the other day. Let's eat it. Let's see what it tastes like. Oh. That's unbelievable. Sausage casing, perfectly seasoned on the outside. It's been deep fried and you know, there's these crumbs on the outside. And I don't know how they manage to get it so perfectly runny. It's a science. I love it. So bang and mash is an old school classic and mother mash well they focus on mash it's the star here now you can get a pie and mash but hey we're about to go for an old school pie very soon but we had to come here and eat the Cumberland pork sausages such a classic with any number of different mashes you can choose what you want we went for champ which is actually an Irish one with some butter spring onions some cheese in there too. Let's taste it. Let's taste it. The mash. Oh, it's so smooth. Um, you can taste like a vintage cheese in there. Little chunks of spring onion. That's incredible. Now you can pick your own gravy here too. We went for the farmer's gravy. It has an assortment of different things. Mushroom, bacon, really tangy. Red wine, bit of onion, brilliant gravy. Just sort of marries everything together. Ooh. Now let's try these juicy Cumberland sausages. They're not as big as some of the other ones, but they pack. 
and some serious flavor. That's amazing. Really sweet and juicy. Like it. Incredible flavor. Amazing quality. And we're in Soho. It's supposed to be expensive. This place is great value. So it's kind of ticking every box. A bit more. Oh, that's good. This is good, guys. Corner is famous with all the Arsenal fans. Years ago, there was one at a match day at the ground, but now they have a few locations kind of across London. Now they make steak and kidney pies, which is an old time classic. Actually, if I'm truthful, it used to be a pudding. Steak and kidney pudding, you can still find in London. My mum used to make that, and it kind of reminds me of that. Anyway, let's check it out, because Pyrebury Corner, you would hope they know how to make a good pie. Let's go. Oh, Woo. hot. Mm. Oh, that's incredible. Really chunky bits of kidney and steak. Let's see if I can show you this. Really earthy flavor. I love the sort of minerals in there from the kidneys. It is fantastic. Steak and kidney, my favorite combo for a pie. For another one, gotta love for another one. It's so weird. Salt and beef. Salt beef. It is such a traditional Jewish food. And you can get them in the bagels here with pickles and they've slow cooked that beef. And yes, it's got a salty brine with it. Look at that, that just falls apart. That's incredible. So good with the pickle. Pickle just adds some acidity because it's so salty. Oh, seriously. Look at how much meat is in there. It's like salt beef with a bagel, not the other way around. I love it. Brick Lane has this place, Bagel Bake. It's one of the most favorite. I think it has like over 5,000 Google reviews with a very high rating. There are lots of other options in London, but these guys are brilliant. That is so good. That is five quid. Best five quid you'll spend. All right, well, we are absolutely packed full of bagels and everything else. Guys, there's a saying in London, back of the net. Seriously, we're done. Be sure to hit all the buttons that you need to, and we will see you very soon. Bye. attack from the pie. <laughs> no. <laughs> Can't <Can't> loss. <laughs>